Hi Gemini, this is Just with your July 6, 2021 weekly general read. I hope you guys are having an enjoyable day so far. So Gemini, you're stressed out about a situation. You're feeling really trapped and stuck. Okay, some of you may have been losing sleep, really stressed out, overthinking a situation. Things are going to change. And for some of you, it will be for the better. Now, others of you, you've got to be careful with how this is all going to play out. We'll get into that in just a minute. For those of you who are self-employed and you're deciding to create some hard boundaries with another person or cut them out of your business partnership altogether, you probably are right to do so. There is something in the air for you Geminis about a making a decision to take a leap of faith or take a risk that you may soon regret. Now, this is something that you may have already done and now you're just going to have to deal with the after effects, uh, meaning you're probably seeing the effects of a risk that you took and you want to leave that behind. You don't want to address it. You don't want to deal with it. It has you stressed out, but you're going to have to deal with it. Now, if this is something that has yet to be done and you are trying to walk away from some type of a risk. Like you have an opportunity to stay in, an, in a situation that is kind of guaranteed, is very stable, it's no drama, it's peaceful. It may be boring, but it doesn't provide all of the drama if you were to take a risk and get into something that's very shaky, it's unstable. You know, you really don't know how this is all gonna go. Be careful. And if you need to rewind that, play it back, please do. Be careful because some of you jumping into something sight unseen, um, leaping before you look is going to be problematic down the line. Now, some of you may have already done this and you're catching hell and you're trying to get the hell away from something or someone that you jumped into something with. That's what I'm saying. And this week, I don't see you just actually running, although some of you could be literally running away from someone and trying to hide from them. But I almost feel like as, as time is going on, you're becoming more and more aware that you need to remove yourself from this situation or run as fast as as you can away from a situation that you know has either become problematic or soon will be problematic. You understand what's going on. Some of you, again, you may have gotten yourself already caught up in it. So running is not going to help. But if you have yet to do so, be very, very careful of the risk that you take right now. Remember, I told you that. Um, and let any other Gemini out there know that, you know, be careful. This is not the time to take too many risks. Just try to lay low uh, um, on the risk taking. Especially if you're bored, be careful with that boredom feeling and feeling like you want to shake things up. And this could be anything, anything, Gemini, you may decide to just pick up and travel somewhere, do something. Again, it's some, an element of risk. You may live to regret that. And I don't want to have to put it on too heavy and make it too negative, but you, but you definitely want to avoid it if you can postpone it, that sort of thing. Um, and it, and again, it could be something where you're making some adjustments and changes in your own business. I see this is more for business Geminis than employed Geminis. Those of you that are employed and have um, a regular traditional job, looks really good. Looks like you guys are being brought in, starting to feel like you're part of the team, or it could just be a very pleasant time for you in the workplace. And those of you who are looking for work, definitely could be a great time to get callbacks, get interest. And this is fast energy. So it's going to happen really quickly for you guys. Just be again, careful with anything that you haven't taken the time to really research. And if your intuition is telling you, no, 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 listen to what your intuition is telling you. Okay. Um, also now your home life looks really good. Great. Um, if you work from home, looks like money is coming in nicely. Um, you're more focused if you're staying more to yourself. I feel like energy is more positive there. It just looks like when you go out or you're around other people is when it can get a little bit trying. So home life looks really good. Something in your home is going to be a blessing or a benefit to you guys. Um, and taking time to rest, if any of you need to rest or heal and recuperate, best thing that you can do, stay out, from, stay out of the street, stay home. Okay, let's get into love. But do remember that there's going to be an opportunity to reconcile, rekindle, work out, compromise, and overcome any issues with someone. And that might be a surprise. You may think that things are going to head down one direction, but it doesn't. In fact, it kind of recovers. Um, and I just keep seeing some of you running away from a, a, a person where it's a lot of toxicity with a person. 
It's very toxic. One part of you wants out. Another part of you, you know, still has faith that everything can work out. So there's that. Let's get into love. <laughs> Gemini single ladies. Well, it looks like you are kind of in your feelings about someone who has strong feelings for you. Things kind of imploded kind of rather quickly. You're holding back, even though this person could be coming back and forth into your life. He hasn't let you go completely, but it seems like you're trying to get over him. Um, you wanted to marry this person. Very confused at this time. You, again, could have found some things out. and It has kind of put everything on hold, but you are either wondering what happened you know, you found out some things or when am I ever going to get married? When am I ever going to be with the person that I want to be with? Um, some of you may even be doubting that you'll ever be in a happy and normal, positive relationship. There's a change and an ending to one person. And it's, it's like, not to say as soon as, but once you get to a place of cutting out an individual is when you start to get more comfortable where you stand in your love life, ladies. I see someone coming in, but it's going to be very slow. And this, this situation can develop into something real. He will be challenged, this new individual that comes into your life, as slow as he moves. It's smart for him to do so because you will be a woman that's more focused on your finances and career. You, I see Gemini's embarking on something huge, school... Um, a new business venture that takes up a lot of your time. But this is something that requires more of your time, your energy, and your focus, okay? And that's what would be more on your mind than a relationship. And I want to say, in, a, in you know, all of maybe even a couple of months. But it's fine because this person is very patient. They like that about you. And this situation, as I said, can develop. The only person that will hold it up is could be some of you ladies because you're very closed off once you finally let go of your past person. Um, you're, you're closed off. So having this person come in very slow as they will, probably wanting to be a friend, could definitely lead to something. Yeah, they will express their feelings for you if you stick around long enough. Um, and you may be giving that person, that new person, a chance while you're still mourning over a past person. Gemini single men. And that'll be good for you going back to you ladies. That'll be really great for you to do, to have a friend, to have someone that you're conversing with and getting to know, uh, because that allows that past energy to kind of let it go and um, pay some attention to someone else. Now, Gemini single men, I do see that there's a woman who you have had a very um, strong liking. And this right now may seem like everything is going just fine, but there is something coming up with this where this may not work out. I get that she's a fire sign. Leo Sagittarius or Aries. She doesn't have to be, but that is her energy. So you may just be very attracted to this woman. She works a lot. She have a lot. She has a lot going on. So it could be hard to pin her down. You've been watching this woman for some time now. She could even be at a distance. For some of you, you may even have a child with this person. Some of you even could be fighting over a child with this person. So this could be the mother of your children, that sort of thing. Um, and I do see there's going to be some type of drama coming up with you and this woman. It could be over children. It could be over time not spent. Something like that is going to happen here. But there's a bit of drama, which may be a very difficult situation. Okay, so it's either one of you men, Gemini single men, one of you, you or this woman may not want to um, get into anything real serious right now. Maybe because of work, maybe because of other things, but trying to make it turn into something deep and committed maybe a bit of a challenge for you guys right now someone wants something more long lasting than the other person um and maybe they could be hiding behind work or family issues in order to keep the other person at bay is what it looks looks like to me um so yeah we can see and talk to each other but only to a point because you know work or kids or you know that sort of thing that's how they're keeping the other person at bay so that's what I see for you, Gemini single men. And some of you, this behavior from this woman may make you want to run back to another woman that is a little bit more consistent. She's more stable. Um, you may not want to be bothered with all the drama that comes with this other female. That's what it looks like to me. Now let's get into uh, couples. This is either a divorce that's coming up, some type of final breakup. A karmic cycle that's definitely coming to an end. Now, let me explain something with you, Gemini couples. 
your person, and it can go vice versa, but your person is coming to the end of the road of a karmic cycle for themselves. You're still in the midst of this karmic cycle, so that speaks to me that perhaps um, if the two of you are trying to work a situation out after there has been a lot of drama, Gemini, you may be at a point where you have already passed your karmic cycle and now you're able to start again. Your person is at a point where they're about to end their karmic cycle. So that means that the two of you could possibly start again the right way, but you can only do that if you've both learned your lesson, if you've gotten the lesson to move forward. Now, for some of you, this could be something major that's going on with your person, work, career-wise, life-changing. This is life-changing that's going on with your person. And because of it, it's changing the dynamic of this relationship. So it either makes the the two of you more available for one another to clean a slate and start from, from this day forward or because of this life-changing thing that's happening for your person it's almost starting to tear on the relationship because it takes you further apart so it really depends because I see here work and I see someone focused on mastering work finances and career and that's what they're all about um, and that's kind of like you have to be okay with it they're okay with it but it may strain the relationship. It's that type of thing. But somebody has to kind of take that leap. So it's something about taking a leap, <laughs> doing something risky, not knowing exactly what the results are going to lead the two of you down, um, will change the dynamic in this relationship. Somebody's also finessing the other person is what it looks like to me. I get work. I get, this is a woman here who is very focused on her work, couples. This woman is focused on business, her work. She may have gotten to a point where she's built herself up and she doesn't rely on anyone at all. Um, and so this woman kind of has a hard line. And if she senses anything is problematic in her life and it's going to stress her out or reduce her down to someone that she's not, she's going to cut out. OK, for some of you couples, I do see you working on trying to repair the relationship, which is where some of the stress and strain is coming from mentally, because some of you are stressed out having to make a final decision. But your relationship is up for review by you, by your person or by God. It's up for review. And this is the make a break time in this relationship. You guys may have three months, a good three months. It's almost like a window of opportunity is here in this relationship to decide where are we going to go next? Because with all of this karmic energy, it's either going to be completely done and someone then gets what they were destined to have because they've learned their lesson. You start from scratch and the two of you can now have a blessed beginning or neither one of you um, get the lesson and you have to repeat this cycle again. So this is kind of like make or break it time when it comes to your relationship, Gemini. For those of you who can relate to this, because there's a lot of things to consider. The two of you are still very much tied. It may have something to do with money, children, assets. There's a lot of other things to consider that you can't just jump and run away from the relationship. You have to kind of consider all the factors, even though one of you or both of you may want to just cut out and let it go. You can't really do that right now. So there may be some time to work. You have a window of opportunity to really work on this. But the, the point is, is are you both in it for the right reasons so you both want it so time will tell so if you're interested in the um love reading for couples want to look any deeper into this relationship you can find the link down in the description box below you could also find all the details that we go over in the extended reading you could also find the 2021 gemini extend it um, yearly for the rest of this year if you want to look at the rest of this year and the link to my website otherwise if you are new to this channel welcome and subscribe because uh, i'll be back very soon with another one take care gemini